Hello there guys and welcome back to San Marino. We are slowly, slowly preparing. Soon we'll have factories will be starting to build up on our steel production, which is good. We do need to steal for the uh, guns and such. Guns require steel to be made. 105 days! Why? But yes, we should be building now. Yeah, it's going to take till the 30th of September. It's too long. But the next idea gives me two. Yes, we'll take that. 140 days for two factories, and then we'll be good. Then we can go for a, for a military factory. I think we'll only need one at first. We'll just take one. We'll start doing other laws and such. Getting things better. It'll be good, so don't you worry. Don't you worry, it will be terrific. Next law, though, what's it going to be? Is it going to be just saving up then? Because we don't want any of these, any of these fellows. Nationalists. Ah, not yet. Industrial man? No. All this stuff. No. Entry equipment designer. No. no, I don't need any stuff. We'll just uh, leave it, I guess. We could do a manpower one. Image conscription, what's he going to do? What's the next part? Factory outputs. 5% less. Ay, ay, ay. Since we don't even have our steel factory built yet, it's not even 10% true. Alright, February, is this the month? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. 30%. You better win, you fool. Have no excuses. None. Deutschlander. Where? 38? Why have you slowed down? You probably haven't, but... They are 31. Went one. Yeah, just going down. Good. You better keep going down. The Germans are going to rise up and have a revolution. They have heard that Angela Merkel stole the election. Now the people are going to start having action. They want reactionary. Yes. Nationalists. No one in the country is a nationalist. Like, seriously. We have elections. Ah. We have elections, dude. I had no idea. Better not steal this election, you fool. Look at him smiling. He knows. He knows. Right. Well. Uh, let's get the uh, San Marino's a little bit weaker then. Maybe a... No, because we don't have any support equipment. We won't have any support equipment. What if we did get... Engineers. Manpower 300. Um, support equipment would take 30 for one division, eh? No, I just wanted to move. Get on with it. San Marinos. Very good. I want speed. More men going in various directions is speed. Easier to encircle your enemies and such. Does Isley even have an army? They don't seem to have grown since the beginning. Whereas France again has. Like they usually do. What's this? Polish workforce in Germany. Okay. 39% to get in there. Move forward. Move. Move. So this guy's face every time, seriously. Just why? Why does he have that face? Not a fan. Not a fan of this man's face. Where was that cool looking fella? 
to South Sudan. Yeah, South Sudan. Salva Kiir Mayadits. That is a cool looking man who's fucking out of the German flag and he's nothing. Have they got have they got a, the main villain, like the, the magician, the magic man? Is he here? No, they got Barrow. No! No, not Barrow. Where's the man with his magic stick? He's always walking around. Jammer. Yeah, where's Jammer? His magic stick and his big white fucking uniform and his stupid hat. He's cool as fuck. We want Jammer. We want Jammer. Yeah. You certainly don't want this fucker. Oh, it's, it happened a month ago. You fucking asshole! Why are you all doing this? Just why? It's even gone up since I did it. Just why? Why are they all being just wankers? This is costing me points. I don't want to be spending out my points on this. These fucking people, I swear. They are bastards. My miracles lots are 40%, let's call it. I need another 10 and they'll be happy how long that takes. These guys, this is why I should never stop. They could be way over 40 by now. Way over. That's cost me half my fucking points. Stupid. I don't want to be losing half my points. No. Putin, we need your help. Get over here and influence. Influence these people. Fascist. There is an actual fascist. That's funny. Nationalist, yeah. Communist, no. Fuck off. Social Democrats, no. Progressives. Really? Progressive social liberals in Russia. No. Belarus, also reactionary, obviously. Balaya. A progressive government, you say? Nationalist, Kazakhstan, I mean Uzbekistan. Yes. Islam. His name is Islam. Oh, it's party. Oh. Nur Otan. Ah, fuck that guy. Yeah, reactionaries is what we want. China, though, they're far too strong. Can we depose North Korea then? No. We would never even think of deposing that great man. Never. The other reactionaries, but yeah, this cool if you fellas reactionary. South Star, easy reactionary, good. Because we are going to want extra reactionaries in the world. No, we're not. No, we want nationalists. Mugabe. How you doing, Mugabe? How you doing, my man? Man, Mugabe. Mugabe. <laughs> Best economist in the world, Mugabe. Now, some people don't understand what humor is, so let me just explain. That was a joke. <laughs> it's a joke. He's not really a good, good economist, no. Precision guided firearm as well. That's a good start. I'm going in a totally wrong direction. Green laser systems, just get our soldiers better. Oh no, I was meant to do the uh, other thing for the extra recruit population eventually. So we're going to want to go down that warrior way, aren't we? I mean, we're going to want to go down that. We want to go mass assault doctrine. Men four fleets, good. Get our soldiers strong. Get men strong. Get men strong. Strong, strong, strong. Yeah. Now that's good. I would prefer it faster, but sure. See, Merkel will get deposed and hung for her treachery. And we'll get this man have the same treatment. Was it not? 34? I just... 
Maybe I see things, I don't know. But the US takes a very long time to get a third party going. So when they run out of other ideas, they start going in that route. Trump. Good old Trump. Causing all kinds of good things to happen. TPP, out of that. Good man, Trump. He had five million women march in the streets against obesity. <laughs> they thought they were the biggest movements ever in US history, but unfortunately for them, uh, there was actually 30 million women who took to the streets in order to vote for Trump just a few months ago. So no, your five million women march in the streets is not, does not show democracy. In fact, it does show democracy because you had five million women marching against Trump, whereas 30 million voted for him. It shows democracy and how the correct man is in power. <laughs> <laughs> yes, good one with your march. Do you see the litter they left? Everywhere. Fucking everywhere they were. Just litter all over the streets. It wasn't piled up around bins. It was literally all over the streets. Disgraceful behaviour. Then they complain why they're not taken seriously. I mean, why would you? Preaching that you want to help the environment against Trump. And you go and just litter every fucking where. Stupid. Take your sturdy science home with you. Fucking vaginas written all over it. Move the vagina. It's a real fucking argument. We live in the United States of America. You're not oppressed. You know who is oppressed? These fuckers over here. Did you go anywhere near their embassy? No. Remember the women's march against the mandatory hijab in this country, Iran? Yes. Yes, you wearing a hijab and saying Trump is bad for disliking these kind of things. That does not make sense. People complained against it here and they were forced to do it against their will. And now you're trying to show it as a, a symbol of liberation. No, that's that's fucking stupid. But do what makes you happy. You don't need to listen to me. I'm a white male. We hit 32,000. Good. It's more people to press into the military. Excellent. Pressing into the military is a good thing. We want that. We just might need a bit more living space. What about this surrounding countryside? Do you need that, Italy? Do you need it? I don't think you do. Funnily enough, I think you should share it. Support artillery does give a lot of breakthrough and soft attack. Soft attack is good. You do breakthrough and soft attack and you're easier to produce. It does need 10 to do it. Um, what was that? That was the factory's good. Oh, oh, ho oh, oh. Now I want to get started with the one military factory. I want to have it actually building guns. Oh, then got a stockpile. Was this uh, material will be done soon? 25th of July. It's a month or so away. I suppose basically. Oh, fucking hell. It's, it's over a month, but it is next month. If you get what I mean. Right, let's get some better armor for our boys. Keep them alive. They got all the best guns. And let's uh, keep them able to use them. Merkel, still alive? 42. They are slowly getting there. This man's going to take a, long, a lot longer because he did not keep up. Oh well. Oh well. Would be nice to fix this economy thing, but I do need to be at war for it. War economy. Yeah. Actually, Evelyn mobilization cannot be done with nationalists. Yes, it can. Or not partial. Nationalists, yes, but only that's for there. So we can't get that far once we turn nationalists. But we can't turn nationalists until these other people have flipped to monarch. No, uh, reactionary. Should we go for France as well? Kick them out. Reactionary. France. See, the problem is with them, they're very powerful. Whereas these other nations, they're not as powerful. So having their, them flip isn't as necessary. Anyone else has got a high reactionary? I mean, 
apart from you, in case no one can, they're not going to do it today. 51% because they are twats. Anyone? Bulgaria? Chris? You have a big fascist movement over here, don't you? Only 5%. Golden Dawn. I thought he was more. I thought they were like super popular at the moment, Golden Dawn. Or is that only in the south where it's very. Very populous. Which again, that would be another very interesting thing with this game. If not only did you have the uh, population split between nationalities, but if you also had the party split per individual province. Say, I am 100% reactionary Italy, I invade 100% communist Switzerland. I'm not, I'm not then going to be 100% reactionary. There's going to be all these populations here to slowly change. And in there, whilst even if we are promoting reactionary, they're still going to be spreading into the other places as they level out their population. Uh, that would ma make the game a lot more complete, something like that. It would be a lot more complete. But hey ho, what are you going to do? Wait for Victoria? Which will probably be dumbed down itself to not have that kind of things. Especially the climate in Sweden, especially Stockholm, they're very anti having a culture. <laughs> that big was that an actual official government meeting where they declared that Sweden doesn't actually have a culture like the Swedish person does not exist or some bullshit? Was it somewhere like that? Fourteen percent nationalist. Yeah, the Nationalist Party is the ones which get a kick out of all this nonsense. The nationalist Party is going to be the ones winning across the board over the next couple of years due to primarily Merkel's choices. <sighs> People are proud of their countries and being told that they shouldn't be proud of their countries pisses them off. That's how you lose power and these left wing parties don't seem to grasp it they'd rather import new voters to outvote the old ones it's it's crazy how corrupt people can be when they only care about votes but what's this three civilian factories oh oh i know what that means it means i want more military i think no we want a radio tower do we do we want a radio tower on a radar station. I think we do. I think we do. Our military factories will start popping out guns, which would be great. More military factories equals more guns. Yeah. But I'll do it for this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I look forward to seeing you lots next time. If you want to support the channel even further, leave a like. Or you can sign up to the Patreon. Even one dollar we do is greatly appreciated. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.